what is happening my YouTube family welcome to underdeveloped and we have a movie for y'all today face oh. watching that fucking Nicolas Cage movie made me make me <laughs> want to go back and relive his greatest hits you know I haven't really seen this movie so it won't be technically reliving anything but you know I'll be kind of building something like I saw this back when I was in middle school a long time ago yeah and he's like 50 so yeah that was like a long time ago the video game created all the Dutch angles in the movie <laughs> that'd be crazy Dreamlike. Oh, it is. This is incredibly dreamlike. You're like, you're misty and shit. Face off. He's dramatically drinking his drink. Oh, this mustache. Oh my god, he looks like such a perv. Oh, he is. <laughs> he is in this movie. He has a straight perv stash. He's trying to kill a kill. Okay, he's trying to kill Travolta. We got some kind of assassin. Mm hmm. Joan Allen is in Okay. Alessandro Nivola. He's drinking. I know, the dramatic closest of a drink you're killing me. I really understand me how old Joe really is. He's, oh, yeah. he's been in movies since the 70s. Mm -hmm. He's old. For some reason, I always thought he was like more like in his like, 90s. Yeah. But he really is not. Oh, he shot him! He did. He got shot! Oh no, you son of a bitch! With his kid is on, oh, what a prick. I don't like Nick Cage. <laughs> now, this is unbearable weight. <laughs> oh, he killed the kid! Oh, you such a. Oh, I hate yeah, him already. It went right through Travolta's body, hit the kid. Oh, what an asshole! Mm -hmm. Where's everybody? I don't see nobody <laughs> running in panic. Yeah, I know, right? No, hey, the, this kid, they can't be the only ones there. Oh my god. Caster Troy. Caster Troy? Oh my god, it's like a video game. <laughs> I hate his stupid hair. His stupid, <laughs> at least I read a purr stash. That purr stash was not in the vibes. Oh, he's about to do something that's going to give you really not good vibes. Do the kid. I don't know how worse we get than that. It's so secret that when we snap our fingers, nothing happens. <laughs> Nose here, just as a priest. Yes. <laughs> oh god, this fucking scene. Why, why is he? Why is he fucking? Why is a fucking sermon going on like going like this? This doesn't seem like the perfect place for this. Yeah, it's like it's like yeah, they're just singing. It seems like it's some kind of like a a new renovated mall or some shit. What the fuck? <laughs> <I know. laughs> the oh, devil got a hold of him. Oh no. <laughs> Why is she fucking smiling? I don't really enjoy the massage. In fact, I think it's fucking boring. The bird boys makes it look like I can't. Why is he doing it right there for everybody? She looks too young, bro. Word. Douglas produced this? Oh, apparently he did. You guys are being protected from everybody, including himself. But stay away from downtown on the 18th. It's going to be a little, uh, smoggy. Sorry, what now? So I assume he's like the super villain. <laughs> Let's go, let's go, on board, let's go. Here you go. Bravo. Would you like anything else once we're airborne? Oh. How do we still have to kill any kid? Sit. Okay, what a misogynistic perk. Oh, he is. You know, I can, uh, eat a page for hours. <laughs> Flowers. Where would I find? 
Wait, let me rephrase. If I were to let you suck my tongue, would you be grateful? Oh.
keeping him alive. Relax, Archer. He's a turnip. <sighs> what if you could walk into Air One Prison and give Pollux a nice big brotherly hug? Wait, what? As Castor Troy. Wait, what? <laughs> Whoa, what? <laughs> Let me try. Uh, am I hearing that wrong? Not the wall. <laughs> no, you're not hearing it wrong. You're hearing that right. What the fuck is going on here? I don't know what I can do. Did I said it was just some sci fi movie. <laughs> Augmentation. Dr. Wallace can alter the likeness, even the voice of a government witness. I think you'll recognize his patient. We have to build your friend Loomis a whole new year from scratch. Oh, so he's had these experiments happening right underneath their fucking noses? <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. What are you suggesting for you, Archer? Isn't it permanent transfer? This is like super yeah. futuristic Just a temporary. They're like super ahead of its time with futuristic technology. Oh, reconstructing so body parts. Synthetic body parts. This is mm -hmm. crazy. What the fuck is happening here? <laughs> Wait, so I'm not gonna see no more of that crazy ass fucking character anymore? There's gonna be Nick Cage being John Travolta? Mm. I'm not saying you're not. Skin pigment. Okay. Eye pigment. The outside exactly. Yeah. Like it's called face. They oh, for face a reason. On top. Not a reason. Who's putting it in facing off or some shit? Yeah, off. that's how they want you to win. But that's not what it's really about. So weird, it's very literal. Face off. Oh. It's insane. <laughs> oh, no you don't even know the half of it. This movie get made. <laughs> this is the, imagine pitching this movie. Oh yes. Nick Cage takes John Travolta gets his face ripped off and literally sewn onto another face so he can go into prison <laughs> to get Ed's out of his brother. You could think of any other ways to do that. He's wearing the face of the person that killed his fucking son. Keep in mind, keep in mind what this performance is. This is the performance of Nicolas Cage pretending to be John Travolta, pretending to be Nicolas Cage. It's such a great. <laughs> Thomas Jane? I think that's Thomas Jane. I wouldn't know. You wouldn't recognize the rest of the development? What do you find? Thomas Jane. Thomas Jane. Thomas Jane. Thomas Jane. Thomas Jane. Thomas Jane. One of, uh, what's her name? Lorraine? I'm forgetting her name. My sister. Lindsay. One of the potential love interests. He thought he was a homeless guy, but he was a nice Oh, yeah, that's him. Oh, that's him. They also did Punisher back in, like, old three years ago. Yeah, but admittedly, admittedly, even if it was actually him, like, he's the kind of guy who would probably make a big scene in his first day anyway. Yeah. You can just tell. <laughs> it's still insane though, but I like the idea. Oh, it's absolutely insane. <laughs> of him learning to be this fucking cop, basically learning to be a criminal inside of a prison. Mm -hmm. It's interesting. Oh shit! Uh, you're going a little too messed with your acting, buddy. Captain Trader sure doesn't show mercy. There's a lot of notable faces in this fucking show, fucking movie. By the way, did 
did you send that chair to be uh did you send that chair to come here? Yeah. Okay, good. So that's the location for it. This movie in the future, honestly. All this tech, all this tech. <laughs> How do you fucking recreate the hair, bro? Wait, maybe. And now, and and now he's doing Cage. <laughs> I'm interested to see how he does Cage. Yeah. It's John Travolta playing Nicolas Cage playing John Travolta against Nicolas Cage playing John Travolta playing, playing, playing Nicolas Cage. Cage. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's that, the plot. <laughs> no wonder this movie got made. Yeah. They fucking pitched that idea. That's and the it idea. was like, yo, has let's make this. Yes, has to make this. Yes, make this. We to have it. to make this. <laughs> we have to make this. <laughs> this is straight up meta, meta, acting, acting, acting. Ludicrous performances. This is the, this is the inception of acting. Yeah. <laughs> Smile! Yeah. You get lucky! <laughs> <laughs> it's like looking in a mirror, only not. In a coma? Nothing like having your face cut off to disturb your sleep. Read the newspaper lately? And he, he, he killed the people involved. Oh, yeah. So now no one knows. Well, Pete's paying the bill, huh? Come on, I mean, uh, if a facelift costs five grand. <laughs> this is so that that fucking frame, choppy frame rate is like so like so two thousands <laughs> with that with that with, 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 with that cut. It's so extra. Yeah. I torched all the evidence that proves you're you. Okay, so wow, looks like you're gonna be in here for like the next hundred years. <laughs> no, I have got to go. I've got a government job to abuse. Lonely wife to fuck. Oh, did I say that? Sorry. I didn't make love to God, I missed that face. <laughs> Thank you for uh, enduring all these years that I was an insufferable bore. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, did you just have a surgical procedure? What do you mean? <laughs> was the stick successfully removed from your ass? <laughs> <laughs> Sir. Yeah, that's the fucked up part. I think Nicholas K. I think he's actually a better version of him than he could be. Yeah. Will you tell the president to hold? Okay. <laughs> Does she like that? Ha <laughs> ha! He's being a man of the future, John Travolta. Nick Cage is a better John Travolta, that's it. <laughs> He's John Travolta, he's better than John Travolta. Is he, the ironic thing, he lobsters? Okay, shit. Russell <laughs> yeah. Sprout, wow. pasta. Yeah, that's how you realize. Like, it's funny, he's doing it just to become a better husband than that. <laughs> that's hilarious. A second serial killer terrorist gets, basically takes the identity of a fucking FBI agent just to become a better person. <laughs> he's like, he, 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 like, he lives his life better than he ever could. Yeah. <laughs> He saves people, he's a good husband. <laughs> to be honest, he probably couldn't figure out that bomb. Dr. Volta wouldn't be able to fix that. I don't know. The next name on my calling list is Lazaro. So you're still selling Hobson and drugs to Cheryl and Phil Roy. <laughs> Cast her fucking dry! Ah, oh, man, you scared me, man! Alright. <laughs> you know, I never should have sold you those bombs. It's my curse. I can't say no to a friend. You can't say no to money. Yeah, that's my other curse. <laughs> you are. What's the matter? What? 
Look at his fucking mother. Come on, let's go relax. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what, what does that even mean? Yeah. What does that even mean? He's vulnerable at home. No. This is Sean Archer we're talking about. This isn't just some boy scout. Fitch. Oh, no, besides. His house is probably alarmed up the wazoo. Code is 101986. That's his dead son's birthday. Don't it just break your heart? Huh. That's brilliant. That's sick. <laughs> How is it that you know so much about Sean Archer? Uh, I, uh, sleep with his wife. Crash <laughs> great. So once we kidnap Super Cop, then what? <laughs> Surgery. <laughs> I'd like to take his his face off. <laughs> he did the thing. He said it. Yep. Face off. Oh. Excuse me, I have to use the little boy's wee wee room. Is he okay? Yeah, he just sick the hilarious. Cat. You want to take his. Face. Yes. His face. Awful. <laughs> Eyes. Nose. Skin. It's kind of awful. The face. <laughs> what, really? <laughs> face. No, I can never stop doing this ever again. I know. Face off. That's why I'm, this this one scene oh is why I've been doing it this entire time. <laughs> Face. Now you understand. Off. You understand my obligation to do it. <laughs> then we'll be set. Then maybe, just maybe, I'll get my freaking face back. Then I'll just have one jag off to take care of. Daddy Masterson? Ha <laughs> ha! There's a lot of notable faces in this. Dude, there's a lot of random ass people in this movie. Carl, stop it. Maybe two. Carl, stop it! Carl, Carl. All right, well, he was... What did you even expect? Right in front of her damn house? Yeah. yeah. And her dad's an FBI agent. You're <laughs> smart. I mean, use your fucking head, idiot. Say you're sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't have it. I'm sorry. I mean it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you like that, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Blow some steam. Dress up like Halloween, and ghouls will try to get in your pants. Typical dad. That is rainy and Be a good dad. <laughs> <laughs> no, you haven't been the same since Mike died. Hiding behind someone else's face. <laughs> Gee, what would he know about that? <laughs> While we're talking, do you have protection? What, do you mean like condoms? Jesus Christ, it's a lot of actual protection. Even I do that, make more. From assholes like him. Next time, <laughs> Carl take his pants down. You chop his nuts off. Twist it, his thigh. Twist it. So the wound won't close. Go on, get out of here. He's really being like a good fucking <laughs> <No>. thing. <laughs> These are like my favorite scenes of the fucking of the movie. <laughs>
you know, catharsis with his son. Mm-hmm. He found catharsis with the with the person who killed his son's son. Yeah. The irony is just bro- the life unbelievable. It's just like irony central. <laughs> so dramatic. Oh yeah. Doves flying rig really? <laughs> it's a John Woo movie. You gotta have the doves. <laughs> Until I go really do. Stop it. No. And the house of God, come on. She wasn't a half bad person. Don't let him grow up to be like us, promise. Yeah. See ya. <laughs> I don't want to say yeah. Like, yeah. No. <laughs> She's being super dramatic. He's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, totally. Totally. Yeah. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, she didn't deserve that. Wanda, Wanda, this is Eve Archer. I have something crazy. I want to go remake of this. In a more modern make, add a little more modern to it. Nah, I feel like I feel like I feel like that would take away from what everything this movie is, though. I think it's doable. Uh, but like, but why, why, why would I get so strong? Really it's how yeah. crazy it is. So make it yeah. more logical was a good point. Even then, who are you going to get that's better for these roles than these two? I, 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 I'm about to make that. But that's what started going on that route, though. But it is a good plot, you know, a, a callous criminal having to fucking live a life of like a goodish FBI agent. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Here's your eyes, Sammy. Shut up! Don't listen to him. Don't shoot. Just, just the scum bitch. The scum bitch. But watch the face. Sammy, kill him. Daughter of mine, it's so wide. Dad, put the gun down. Put it down. She's already so confused. Like, what the fuck is going on? What the fuck is happening right now? Peaches. Oh no! Say goodbye to Papa. Oh yeah. 
weapon, the weapon that you, the weapon, irony, the ultimate irony, the ultimate irony, the weapon that you gave her, you asshole. <laughs> it's just like he doesn't have to be killed. He just is not. It's so unnecessary. <laughs> like he just, he just killed me just for sport. He is absolutely. <laughs> I gotta say, this, this is one hell of an action film. <laughs> we really need more action films like this nowadays. Mm-hmm. Young kid, young kid movies are the same. Yeah. Yeah. This for modern day, then there would be like, tw- then this would be like the opening of like twenty different sequels. Like, oh yeah, just from the cage from this universe to the cage from that universe. anymore I think this is ridiculous it is but I do like yeah. the idea of um but I do like the idea of the, of the plot of the central plot which is to a criminal living in the life of a but that basically the part of yeah. two in a way like as I said before if you want to do that in Marta you'd have to do something like a mind some sort of mind transfer so no what I'm saying is that I like the idea of um of this the face transplant thing anyways well, that, yeah that's what I'm saying like you'd have to change the method of changing the faces yeah you do a conscious thing Make it more futuristic. Yeah, they, that's the only way it would really make sense to make this one go magic, I guess. Hey, Freaky Friday. Fun time. Yeah, that was a good time. <laughs> that movie was Nutbar 57. Oh, yeah. 
I mean, it was good. It was it was, it was, it was solid. At first, I was like, okay, it's always insane. It's nuts over the top. I don't know exactly how I feel about this movie. Um, it's probably going to be some insane Joe Schumacher level crazy. <laughs> but then I'm like, as soon as the plot really kicked in, I'm like, okay, this is interesting dynamics. I love the irony. Mm-hmm. I love the parallels. This movie is like shock full of irony. Yeah, and I'm like, you know, I'm, I was here for it. The plot she got good, the movie actually really started getting good. I just wish they just fleshed out the B plots and the B characters. It's a little bit more just to, because the thing yeah. is, I, I want these characters to go into, like, because they tease these characters going on different, like, emotional journeys. You know what I mean? Like, we are walking in each other's shoes and, and changing and becoming. Yeah, they they becoming better versions of themselves. Yeah, I would like to see a little more of that. Yeah, like that, that was some of the best parts. Of exactly. The movie. So if you guys flesh out more and had these people, so when you get to this final conflict, they're they're the the change actually fundamentally changed people. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like it would have been a little, a little bit a little more gripping in my opinion, like yeah. emotionally. I just uh, hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you like this, thumbs up, thumbs down. It is what it is. Leave your comments. If you watch this movie, let us know what you think. Mm-hmm. And stay tuned for more movies and more stuff we're gonna cover because it's yeah. gonna be a lot. You have done so, come your way, folks. So hit that like and subscribe button and peace out. Later, y'all. Remember, boys and girls, don't put it in your mouth. Hey, what am I doing? I don't even like it.